Congratulations. You've almost completed Adobe's Preparing Students for the Future with Essential Creative Skills course. This course has shown that one of the best ways to promote creativity and teach creative skills is to actively produce and share your ideas with others. And the following exercise aims to help you practice that approach. To receive your official Preparing Students for the Future with Essential Creative Skills badge, you will create an Adobe Spark page to focus your vision and share with others to inspire them and ultimately cultivate essential creative skills in your students. Your Spark page can include as many ideas as you wish, but it should include at least these elements. One, your definition of at least one essential creative skill and why that skill is important for your students. Two, a brief vision for how you might cultivate a creative skill in your course, department, or school. Three, a brief example or summary of an assignment prompt that illustrates your vision. Let's take a look at some of the creations made by others you've met on the course. Looking at the different essential creative skills, I want to focus on one in particular among all of these, and that is communication. Now, I define communication, this essential creative skill, as sharing ideas, sharing thinking, and questions through various mediums. A medium can be through music, through art, through uh, illustrations, th through video. And in this case, I want to talk about video in this particular example on way of how you can incorporate this essential creative skill in the classroom. This idea is capturing emotion. Now you can ask your students to share a space that is meaningful to them, capture it with a video, use a mobile phone or a camera, and then narrate on why this space and why this area is important to them. And this is another way for students to be able to share and communicate what is important to them through this medium of video. I define critical thinking with digital tools as an essential creative skill that students need to develop as they move through their lives. In this day and age, if students leave school without knowing how to apply their thinking in a digital tool, in a digital space, such as with a presentation or a video, they will be left behind. And so I incorporate digital skills to my final projects in my K-12 and in my higher ed project in my higher ed classrooms, because I believe that um, those final projects are a great place for students to really practice the intersection between uh, digital thinking, creative thinking, and critical thinking. For example, one of my assignments is to complete a full research project, whether they're eighth graders, 10th graders, or freshmen in college, by creating a podcast instead of a research paper that they've written you know, on the computer. And a podcast involves interviews and creative thinking and weaving together the story in ways that are uh, transferable skills into the future. You've seen what can be done. Now, it's your turn. It's time to get started on your journey as a cultivator of essential creative skills for all and share what you've learned with other educators and your community.